The Clark County School District is canceling all winter sports for all Valley schools. Sports affected include basketball, bowling, flag football, and wrestling. Tonight we're hearing from a Green Valley High School senior who is devastated. She says flag football is more than just a sport for young women. It's an opportunity for a future in college, and this news is only making it harder for senior athletes. <laughs> Having the opportunity to play flag football, like it's just opened up so much for the girls. Green Valley High School senior Alexandra Nancer is holding up her championship rings from flag football. Tonight, she told her team the news that the Clark County School District is canceling all winter sports. It was hard for them to hear it too. I remember I sent like the text to the group chat and everyone was just upset, but I had to remind them, hey, we still have a backup plan. So it's not all over, it's not all done. All of our work is still like for something. That backup plan Nancer is referring to is a private league. The Southern Nevada Flag Football Coaches Association started at 12 schools in case this would happen. Uh, the Coaches Association organized a league and a schedule and a playoff, so those 12 schools are going to get a chance to play flag football. Those 12 schools that will be able to play under the governor's mandate will offer a last chance for some seniors. So club league like it's important to the girls who like need that last chance, like the seniors this year, like myself, like we need that last chance to be able to get a scholarship. The other winter sports affected include basketball, bowling and wrestling. Nancer has advice for her fellow athletes. If you're a senior, like keep going, keep working. There are schools who will give you an opportunity and I, I don't think you should ever stop. If it's your goal, then you should go for it. Her coach hopes empty classrooms and now empty fields will all be worth it. You know, maybe missing the winter season while in the short term, you know, is obviously devastating for a lot of young players around town. Hopefully it's able better for the whole Valley as a whole. Moapa Valley athletes can participate in sports under the hybrid learning model. Basketball and wrestling are still on the governor's no playlist and high school football will still kick off in February.